In this video I am going to show you how to do the quick setup of your Canon Pixima TS3725 printer with a Windows laptop using a USB cable. This is a printer USB cable and it doesn't come with the printer you have to buy it separately. Although this printer is capable of using the Wi-Fi network it is a wireless printer and if you don't have Wi-Fi even then you can use the printer's internal Wi-Fi to connect with the smartphone. But using this cable will make your printer to work faster. Data cable looks like this. It has a different connection for the printer and that's the USB connection for your laptop. So let's connect it. Go to the back side of the printer. Here we have the USB connection. So we will just install it here and then we will connect the other end to your Windows laptop. So that goes at the USB port. Now it should be installed instantly. We don't have to do more things. But in case you don't have drivers for this printer, then you have to go to the Canon IJ setup. So first we are going to just check here. Go to the start button and open the settings. Settings is here in the settings you have to click on the bluetooth and devices scroll up and look for the printers and scanners in this list we have to look for our printer it should be canon ts3700 series select it you will see the printer setting let's click on the print test page that will give us a confirmation if printer is already connected properly or not. So that is the Windows test page. Definitely printer is connected. For scanning, we don't have the option here, so go back. Look for the second option, TS3700 series. Here we have the scanner settings. Click on the open scanner. This will open the Windows scan app. Now you can download this app from the app store. That is from the Microsoft store. Here we have to wait for the printer to update. In this screen you have to select your scanner. So click on this button and look for the Canon TS3700 series. Select file type. You can save it as a JPEG or PDF and load a paper in the printer and click on the preview. This will give an idea like your page will look like this. If you are happy with that, you can click on the scan icon and then it will scan and save. So this way we can do the quick setup of the printer and then we can start using it for printing and scanning using the printer USB cable. Thanks for watching.